Philippe Bobin. I am the MDC of Potec Limited. Potec is the company bringing in this product. We are supplying and distributing across Nigeria. And what is product all about? We call it hybrid carburetor. And hybrid carburetor allows you to run your existing petrol generator on gas. Now, that's not all. You can as well run petrol on the same carburetor. This is what your regular carburetor looks like. This can only run on petrol, it cannot run on gas. However, the hybrid carburetor we have, as you can see, has a gas chamber and a knob from where you can switch between LPG and CNG. LPG is liquefied petroleum gas, which is the uh, gas we use to cook domestically in Nigeria. And then CNG is industrial gas. It stands for compressed natural gas. All right, if you take a look at the two carburetors, you will notice that the carburetors look alike, except that this other one has a gas chamber. Now, this is for generators of capacity between 2.5 to 3.5 kV generators. And the bigger one, as you can see, has a tail light cord. It's for generators between the capacities of 3.8 kV to 10 kV generators. All right, you will also need the regulator to regulate the gas you're supplying to your generator, just like you do to your gas cooker. And you will also need a clip. All right to clip your hose like we have it here you will need to clip this to your generator to your hybrid carburetor and then another clip to clip your cylinder you go to the gas cylinder and this is all you need to run your generator uh, but what are the benefits of running your gas on petrol um sorry what are the benefits of running your petrol your generator on gas the benefits are enormous one if you run your generator on gas, there is no more smoke coming from your generator. Smoke is entirely eliminated. Two, the noise of your generator is reduced by 30 to 50 percent when you run on gas. Again, the life of your generator is prolonged. That is to say, if your generator were to last for three years, it cannot last for as long as six years. This is because the combustion process is almost eliminated. Now, this is the process where your generator converts your petrol to gas before consuming it. In this case, you are running directly on gas, so that process is almost eliminated. And that's why just why you don't have smoke coming out of your generator. Your spark plug will also last for as long as three to four years when you run your generator on gas. It is safer, it is cleaner, and gas is always available. Even at the current rate of gas, it is three times cheaper than running your generator on petrol. We will go out now to show you how the technology is done is simply for you to remove your existing carburetor out of your generator and then mount um, the hybrid carburetor on the same slot. You keep your generator and you are good to go. All right, now notice, remember also that this does not affect the voltage of your generator. I mean the power voltage or the electricity output. You get the same value. We will go out and show you how it works now. Thank you. Okay, as you can see, the generators we have here are already installed with our hybrid carburetors and they are ready to run on petrol or gas. We are going to show you how the installation is done. And uh, I have one of my engineers here, Mr. Bolaji, who is going to teach us how the installation is done. All right? As you can see, he's removing the generator tank. He has removed the air flow meter or air filter if you like. That is the existing carburetor that is removing. Alright, as you can see, this is what the original carburetor looks like. And then it brings out the hybrid carburetor. It simply inserts same in the same position. Right, the plus bar the choke. This is the hybrid carburetor being installed. Right, it's coupling it back.
tightens with the same screws. This is a brand new generator. This works on virtually any other generator except for Yamaha generators. And then the, of course, a better pass my neighbor kind of Tiger generator. These are the accessories. Okay, he brought this out from the same generator earlier. And he's coupling it back. In a moment, the gem will come up. Okay, next, he's plugging in the gas hose into the generator, the carburetor, uh, gas outlet, and that's all we need to do. This is the regular regulator you use on your cooker. It turns it on, and that's all we have to do. As you can see, the joint is without the petrol tank, so you won't see there's any petrol anywhere. And the generator here, the generator comes on. This is the tank right on the ground. You can see there's no connection between the tank, just oh, on its own. And then we have the generator is running. It's running completely on gas. 